What up, everybody? It's your boy, Buff Pro. And this is the beautiful Amber. Broken Surprise! Heart. <laughs> Broken heart has entered. Yeah. yeah. All right. So check this out, man. Um, I know I promised you guys we would do a Q&A. I asked you guys for some questions. And uh, you guys did pretty good. There's some pretty good questions here. Yeah, Not I think so much we're... for me. I don't think I got any questions. Oh, you got a few good ones. Really? I think there's a few good ones. Yeah. I don't think yeah. anyone really cares about me, but we'll see. All right. I don't mind being the Kelly role in the end. <laughs> Kelly was the main character. The ugly one, yeah. She was the main character. Beyonce was pretty cool. No way. Sarah was Ooh. my favorite from Destiny's uh, Child. Walter Polly. Good morning, Dane. Question. How did you and Ken meet? And how did you guys end up being friends? Wait, was Ken supposed to be in this? <laughs> <laughs> no, but... This I can is a get question. my glasses, but I don't think I make a very good Ken. <laughs> I get this question a lot. Me and Ken actually met at a card shop playing Magic the Gathering. And uh, that's actually how we bonded was playing Magic. And then um, he was cool. I was also big into Halo at the time. Uh, I was competing, traveling. And some of my friends uh, was like, yo, you play at the college, blah, blah, blah. And it was like, yeah, well, you should come play with us. So he sh got invited and showed up to my place and yeah, just kind of kicked it from there. Ken and I met at a park in Mississippi completely randomly. Um, we just all happened to be there. And I was like, hey, oh, yeah. isn't that your friend? And uh, yeah. Yeah, that is true. And his wife are actually really nice, by the way. <laughs> a behind the scenes action there. And their kids are <laughs> adorable. You can hear that from me. Did that, it actually was pretty funny. We were at, the, at the park. Uh, just randomly that day. Yeah, and they just happened to be there. And we and just kind of like, oh, was hey. walking. I was like, I know that. Yo, is that Ken and Mary? And it was. So next question. Daniel Reeves. How often do people think your name is Dave, Dean, or Dwayne? Yeah. Other than Danye, because my daughter and I think your name is Danye. Danye is the best. I've never called you any of those. I literally call him that, like in public. <laughs> So. They do. I yeah. actually, I, I, I almost prefer Danye because... He actually because responds to it. But yeah. I mean, how often are you called those other names? As a fellow Dane, I get I get Dave, Dean, and Dwayne all the time. I get Dan even, being from Mississippi, and I don't know how people think I mean Dan. They're like, what's your name, son? But if, you, but if you think that's bad, my name is Amber, and I've been called Amanda my whole life. <laughs> constantly like literally people will ask me my name and still call me amanda to wow. date. so yeah. at least like dane and dean or dane and dan are like missing a letter how do you go from amber to amanda like i don't it, it's quite the leap but i guess yeah. I like, so. <laughs> fair solex one of the old schools asked uh dane what's the best dish you can do right now that i make do you cook not in this house Man, I do a mean cereal. Yeah, you do a mean toast. <laughs> Egg, eggs and chicken is all he makes. <laughs> and that is not an exaggeration. Since I've met him, that's all he makes. Put him on a grill and he's amazing, but that's not what he actually makes. What he makes is chicken and eggs, period. Throw some salsa on there if you're feeling really thirsty. I, yo, I put salsa on that drink every time. Racial stereotypes. <laughs> I do, and cheese. Jesus Seriously, everything. I really do. Next part. Amber, what's the annoying thing Dane does currently? Currently? Other than everything? <laughs> um, probably a tie between not putting a trash, a, a bin liner, if you will, back into the trash can or leaving the toilet seat up when there's two girls in the house. Uh, probably one of those. Yeah. Pretty bad. Yeah, I walk from Mississippi and sometimes it's hard for me to remember to pee in the toilet, let alone... I mean, I offered you a litter box, but you said you didn't want one. So nah, I mean, at just, this point, I just pee outside. You know what I mean? Like, could you pee off the balcony at least, so we can get like paid for like? <laughs> you want to go to the showers? <laughs> Monica says, "Danie, do you have la español?" No. What is it like growing up in Mississippi as a Hispanic person? Ooh, uh, I can't relate because I'm not Hispanic. Do I know Spanish? No. <laughs> no. Of course, I know Spanish. No habla español. My llamo es. Biblioteca. I know more Spanish than Dane. Que hora es? That's embarrassing. Mato. What does that mean? What does que hora es mean? What time is it? Mm. De donde es? Mm. 
Cállate. That's where you're from? I thought you were from <laughs> Anyway, what's it like growing up in uh, Mississippi as a Hispanic person? Um, not great. Yeah. Yeah. I, uh, well, there's what's not... What's it like being from Mississippi and being not white is the better question. <laughs> well... <laughs> Tech, well, you say that. I don't know. Like, I don't know. I'm not from I, the, Well, the town I grew up in, I don't know. It was, it was a very split ratio. It was very, almost even of black and white. Um, but I was the... There was another Hispanic person. I remember that. There was like four of us in the whole school that I remember my whole time going. So, Yeah. Uh, you get looked at weird and you, you, you get, you get lumped in to just wherever it's convenient at the time. You know, think, I'm sorry. I don't like how much taller I look than you on camera. I I'm, like I'm, I'm like, slouched. I look like I'm like I'm six, four on camera. I'm like eight, don't two I and know? I'm slouched. You know what I'm saying? Second part of the question. Amber, have you also tried Kay's cooking recipes as Dane is created? If you'd like to see me try one of Kay's recipes, please watch the last video on this channel if you'd like to see me suffer um, <laughs> so that was the first and unfortunately probably not the last time i've had to try that um yeah i thought it was great <laughs> hannah irene for amber did you live in philly prior to meeting Nane? yes i'm not from mississippi um but yes i'm from the philadelphia area i was born and raised here please don't do the will smith theme for Fresh Prince, I hate it. Um, I did live in Maryland for a spell, um, and I've worked in multiple states, but yes, I'm from this area originally. Bill Party. Now, Bill. Ooh, that is the best last name ever, Party. And listen, Bill Party. Ooh, ooh. Also, shout out to Bill, because this man hit some pretty good questions. And I tried to get, I think I have multiple of Bills, because I like them. I was like, oh, Bill hooked it up. So anyway, Bill says, if you could clothesline just one of the predators you and Ken have reviewed so far, which one would it be? Now, I also put some of the replies in here because to be honest, I think uh, Deanna actually answered the question for me because it is so what I would do. Deanna says, this is my favorite so far. I think he'd say F the rules, line them all up, clothesline them all, and then for good measure, tase them. Does that sound like me? I'm pretty sure that you wrote that. <laughs> <laughs> That's my other account. I don't know who Deanna is. <laughs> it's, it's really Dane. Andy. I said Dane, and there was like, oh, Deanna. They, someone made it for me. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? That yeah, that sounds way more accurate. <laughs> <laughs> Jocelyn Garcia. How long have you known Ken? And then how did me and you meet? Okay. I don't know how long you've known Ken. I've, you have to answer I've known Ken for, oh my God, since I was like 18. 19? Do you remember that far back? <sighs> so yeah. around like 200 BC? Yeah, like electricity came in somewhere around there. Black and white TV. Mm. Still a thing. The edge of sketch. What a, what a great school. invention. How did we meet? Um, well, being that he's from Mississippi and I'm from Philadelphia, I hit the DMs. <laughs> I mean, I could go into the story, which is pretty hilarious, but I mean, I feel like I should save that for like a Twitch stream or something because that would be really cute. But. Yeah, we met online, like all the other couples in their 30s. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Emma Jane Dempsey says, Buff, what's your favorite part of being a stepdad so far? Uh, Honestly, the fact that she's hilarious. She is. To be honest, I, my favorite part so far is like, like realizing, like her accepting me. You know what I mean? To me, that is a uh, crucial, it, that hit me. It hit me in the feels pretty hard, and it was pretty awesome. You know, it was just like, Danye, that's my stepdad. You know, and then when she gets scared, we go for walks. And if she gets scared, like, here's the thing is like, it's so funny. We'll go for a walk at night, right? And there's Halloween decorations up. And she won't flinch at the scariest, most terrifying horror scenes. However, have you met her mother? We <laughs> walk her life. <laughs> it's horror movies and true crime. We walk past a tree, and she'll be like, oh, she'll like run up to me, Danya, I'm scared. I'm like, oh, it's okay, baby, don't worry. I she won't thought let, it was Slenderman. I won't let that tree move. I got this, you know? And uh, it was just really cool. I don't know, she trusts me. I like that part the best. Lukewarm garbage, that name is awesome. 
so happy for y'all. Do you believe in the paranormal? Has anything really spooky ever happened to you? Okay, so true crime Halloween aficionado here. No, I don't believe in any of that. I think it's fun to be like jump scared, but no, I don't believe in it. I believe in like, well, like guardian angels, kind of, but not, I don't seriously think they're ghosts or a thing, but I would love to go to like haunted house or something because I'm really jumpy. What about you? You believe in that stuff? I, I, it depends on the day. Yeah, no, I don't. It depends on the day for me, right? So like, I, I so badly want to go ghost hunting, right? I, feel like I, I want to go ghost like hunting, but I'm also first. like scared because I'm like, what if I find one, then I got to fight him. I don't know how to fight a ghost. I'm going to have salt, like, like, oh, the bug assault gun. Yo, we need that. I'm telling you. I I've been trying to convince like, her that we need the bug assault gun. I believe in like spirits and stuff, but I don't seriously think like paranormal activity, like doors close. And oh, yeah. No, <laughs> ain't no spirit going to drag me across the room. I know that. What up, y'all? That was just some of our favorite questions that we had asked for the q a i hope that you know we continue to do community stuff like this and uh you know it was a lot of fun also there was more questions and we even answered some more and maybe we'll do another video later where we fit those in maybe i'll just throw one out there squeeze it in in between stuff every now and then but uh those were some of our favorite ones anyway i appreciate you guys I will catch you next time.